Well, on my way to Oklahoma, Grand Lake for the Anglers in Action and the Ozark Mountain Team Trail. And I've gotten down here, it's about five o'clock. I'm on 44 going west. And I'm not gonna lie, the sky is a little um, bubbly for us who live in the Midwest. You just get a sense. No, it feels stormy. It just looks stormy. It's Oklahoma. They can like hail the size of like beach balls or something. Yep, I'm gonna say beach balls might be a little extreme, but you know, I don't wanna get my boat hit by any hail. Anybody lives here in the Midwest or even to the south of Texas, you know what it feels like. Today's one of those days. Storms are nearby. I got your Dr. Pepper, I got jerky, and I got you a sandwich. Is it a breakfast sandwich? Yeah, it's like, they look fresh. There's a bunch of fresh mice in there. I got your ham and cheese croissant. I'm gonna grab a candy bar, and that's it. Go over here on this side. Yeah, Okay. It's Grand Lake of the Cherokees. It's Anglers in Action. Gary Scharcher and myself are after, after it again. $17,000 between purse and incentives up for grabs for us for the win. But it's rained, and it's rained all night. Neither one of us likes to fish in the rain. But, sometimes they bite. Here we go. Hey, so we're gonna straighten it out. Gary signed up, boat 107. Yes. But it's really, we're in my boat, not his. Okay, so even though, he's gonna be the only Right. And uh, we didn't, uh, we want to get in Big Bass and Side Pot. And I don't think we got in that. Yep, so. Is it, how much is it more? $40. Feels like it could fly. $340. Thank you. against this bank here to the right.
was, but grabbed hold of my chatter. Yep. On this side. Oh. Gary, short sir. Thank you. Will you just tag him? Oh my god. Can you get it good? He's 15. Is it pumping water in there? Co-anglers, you had a cameraman. And we came out of this resort back here, Red 11. Oh God, that's a big one. Net in the water, net in the water, here it comes. It ain't that big. I did too. It's one more than we had. God, came off again. Again. I gotta save us. He pulled hard enough to scare us. He scared me. Fires, anything? He's our kicker, baby. Yeah, we're going down that bank. Did you see that bird over there? Oh, yeah. He actually hit it though. On the pause. Haha. <laughs> Number four, right? Number four. 
Yeah, something Gary and I did notice that most of the boat traffic was going into the pockets and bays where the spawning is happening. So uh, we decided to uh, fish outside of those areas and we immediately got bites. So it made a difference for us. Here we go. There he is. Yep. Here, I'm just going to bring it right to you. It's a big one. That's a pretty good one. <laughs> Yeah, she smashed it. Jeez! Yes! He hit it like a big one. Oh my god, he jumped. He's not that big. No, he's not, but he'll call. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Here he comes. Spotlight. Oh, you're a stud net guy today, Gary. How many times have you done that today? Three? Yeah. That's three times? Oh, hold on. I want to do it. You come up here and drive. I got red ones. That guy just saw like I catch one on the white. I wonder where the beam is. I saw the beam that's in the bottom of that. Perfect. Need to put just a little water over here on this side. Yes, just knock slack in it. Do you hear me? Holler. I bet knock the rod out of my hand. It is. Goodbye, blue. It's red. I don't know that I've retired. Don't, don't shoot. And then. Uh huh. Yeah, in anyway. That's all good. There's obviously something out there. The them the crappie guys are. Oh, I like it. We gotta keep keep trying to play this out of the pocket deal. I'll play out of the pocket. That sounds fun. Maybe that's because less guys are fishing. Yeah, well, that's what I mean. Just out of the spawning bay.
Help. Oh God, it's dripping me. Okay, it's a big one. Right? No, no, she was pulling so hard I want to give her just a little because of that. Look. I don't know. Come drive. I see her. Let's come drive. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. Red. Come up here, Red. I don't know. I don't know if she's going to beat Red or not. I'm not sure Red's our smallest now. Doesn't beat Red. He's definitely it. We got a little fish loose. Oh, yellow. Yellow, yellow, yellow. We got to check yellow against this one. Okay. So we did, so we did, we did make a little call. Not a goo that often. No. Oh yes. If it's a bass. Come up here, I got a call. I already got it on. I think it's blue. The green came off. I think it's blue. I think it. I don't think it. It's, look, it's pretty healthy. Okay, so. Blue. Moving on up. Moving on up. One oh seven. One oh seven. He's heavier than you think, that one is. Three for six. Twelve pounds. Probably. It's not a bad fish. Pump it all the way, hang it, get down on the ground and 
I'll just weigh him and we'll come right over here. Uh, Blake is somewhere. If not, we're going to be in the dress. Set those down, David. Nice bag of fish, David. Nice job today. 14.29 pounds. Thanks for fishing with us. Up next, we have boat number 35. You want to fish with a couple? Sure. Anglers and action crowds pretty competitive. We had 14, 40, 30, something like that, and um, fell out of the money. They paid uh, 24 places. I think we ended up in round 30th. <laughs> had a good time, called up. Not everything went exactly as planned, but uh, often that's how competitive fishing is. So. Hey, you like the content of these videos? Leave me a thumbs up. Consider subscribing. Until next time, thanks for watching. Hey, what's up? Oh, we just weighed in. I'm over here uh, getting ready to pay. And then he's going to leave, and you and I have this nice... Uh, right so are you on your way and all's good, right? We're fishing tomorrow for sure, right? Yeah, I'm on my way. I'm, I'm getting close. 